Wonder Girl. Hate to break you away from your midterm studies, but I'm going to get some dinner. Do you want anything? Uh, no, it's okay. Doug and I already got something to eat, so, um, you're alright. Oh, alright. What are you working on? Oh, um, something for physics. I just have to write this analysis of Schrodinger's cat. Schrodinger's cat? What's that got to do with physics? Well, it's not a real cat. It's this, um, thought experiment created by this guy named Schrodinger to explain away quantum mechanics. That sounds complicated. Makes sense when he explains it. So explain it to me. So you got this metal box and you have a cat in the metal box. There's no windows or anything. And it's got a vial of poison on a Geiger counter. What's that? It detects radiation. So, uh, okay, you place a subatomic particle near the Geiger counter and it will either emit radiation or not. But the moment it does, it shoots all the poison into the air so it, it kills a cat. Jesus. Yeah, kind of cruel, but it's, it's all theoretical. You know, you would just put a cat in a box. So what's that supposed to mean? So if you don't open the box, you know, the cat's either alive or dead. Instead of the cat being one or the other, it's, uh, it's both. But only when the cat is observed can it fall into either category. Dead or alive? Pretty much. So what? Yeah, some friends, uh huh? Why do you have to make such a big deal out of everything? Tracy, how could you not make a big deal out of this? I know my limitations, okay? And you know what? Grace, some people can't be straight edge. Grace, some people have issues. Yeah, you know what's an issue? This, Tracy, this is a goddamn issue. Don't you ever take my shit, okay? Do you understand that? Tracy! Tracy, please! so different from when you do it than when I do it. Because I know when to stop, Tracy. You know, sometimes all it feels like you care about is the goddamn dope. I mean, shit, you were top of your class last semester. Now it seems like you don't care about anything. I care about you. Doc. I'm sorry, Tracy. I can't be friends with the goddamn jockey. your things you're leaving tomorrow what you can't do this to me I'm your friend you know this isn't practical Tracy I, I warned you before you went down that road and you did it anyways you fail because you don't listen 